Here, here, sit, sit. Dead bird. Back. Doing some shoreline down the shore drills. Decoys there. We got decoys over here. And Delta going to the back bow. Ick. She needs to get close to the shore, but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna push that issue just yet. She's going over there now. Now we're gonna have to get her off the shore. Back! That's a good turn. Carry it. Back! Stay off that land. This is all attrition. No, no collar whatsoever. Back! And this is her first shoreline blind. Back! Miss Major. No! Over! Here! Back in the water. Back! 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 Now she's ping ponging. There we go. Now she's thinking about it. Back! Give her a bump backwards. Now then, she's getting it picked up. I don't know if y'all can see that or not. Filming back toward the sunrise. I want her straight back in the water to me and bingo. Good girl, come on. And you know, this blind right here is 100, 115 yards, right down the shoreline. The decoys here, decoys over here, creating suction, suction on the land, suction right here for misalignment whatsoever. She did a real, real, real good job. And you gotta run a ton of these to get a great handling dog that understands a lot of concepts. So, you know, I'm put a bunch of feeder decoys over here and I'll probably run some blinds past them here before too long. I don't like to run blinds too close to them as far as picking stuff up in them because dogs get used to running two decoys easy enough as it is during duck season. Right now we're training to not do that. Good girl, come on. You doing good, yes you are. Gunners up, bird boys get ready.